Hey y'all, welcome back to Squatch TV. On this episode, another knife box opening. So let's get right to it. So what we got here is a petrified fish. I got another one of these last week that I'll show you. I'll do a little comparison. Comes with a little cleaning cloth. This is pretty nice. It comes with extra screws and extra washers. Very cool. And then there is the knife. Blue micarta scales with black blade and hardware. Now this is a front flipper, so I'm still getting used to doing that. So bear with me if it doesn't work. That kind of works. See, it's just a different, it's a different movement for me. And I've also seen guys do it with their front finger. <laughs> I'm definitely going to cut my finger off doing it that way. But I think I can get used to that thumb once I get used to, once I get used to holding it a certain way. Anyway, get the fingerprints off. Isn't it beautiful? It is a beautiful blade. Isn't that nice? <clears throat> so, some specs. Uh, I bought it on eBay for 48 bucks. I think there were, I think it was five bucks to ship, 4.95, something like that. Uh, so it was a good deal. Overall length is 8.35 inches, blade length 3.62, blade thickness 0 0.154. The blade is made from K110 steel, and I believe that's, and is that from uh, Austria? I think, I was reading about it earlier, I think it's, from, it's a steel from Austria. Uh, K110. It's got a plain edge, black stone wash finish. finish. Uh, blue micarta handle. The weight is 5.61 ounces. And she is just a beauty. Got the little lanyard hole tucked inside, so no hole in the scales where it should be, right? And it's just a gorgeous knife. There's that center shot that everybody likes to get. It's really a cool knife if I could ever figure out how to open it easy. Oh, almost had it that time. It's just a different movement than your finger flippers or your thumb studs. What a beauty, right? So last week, I got the petrified fish in what they call... Uh, G Mascus scales. And this is the mini. Let's see if I can get this one open. Oh. Oh. Hey, there we go. So that's the mini. And there is the full size. A bit of a difference. Let's put you down on the table here. <clears throat> So there's the mini, and there's the full size. The full size, and the mini, right? The full size is a great, great full size knife. So I'll compare it to, let's do some closed comparisons. Uh, the SOG TAC XR. It's right there in the same ballpark. A little bit different shape, but as far as size goes. And then the Civivi... Ah, gee, I forgot what you even called this thing. I apologize. Uh, it's the latest Civivi button lock that everybody loves. But that is about the same size as well. And then we'll open them up. Hey, I did okay that time. And they are definitely 
right there about the same size. I like this thickness on the petrified fish and I am in love with the blue micarta. So it, some people call it blue micarta. Some people are calling it denim micarta. Uh, I just, I love the looks of it. And petrified fish also has this with a silver blade. Uh, same steel, that K111 steel. Is that what I said, K111? K110 steel. But they have it with a silver blade, which looks pretty cool too. But for some reason, that black just really does the trick for me. So there you go. For 48 bucks, I just couldn't help myself. And then this one I got for... Gee, I think I got this thing for like 25 bucks. They sell new on eBay for 35, 32, something like that. But that's a great knife too. So a petrified fish. I don't know how uh, how long they've been in business, but they're going to get a few of my dollars along with Sog and Civivi as usual. Both cool blades. So, there you go. Quick little 6-minute review on the Petrified Fish Beluga Front Flipper. Okay, ready? We're going to do it this time, right out of the gate. And not too bad, not too snappy, but not too bad. I don't know. I think uh, the Front Flipper, uh, I should probably not say anything yet. But so far, since I'm so new to it, it's my least favorite. I like, oh, that was pretty good. I like thumb studs and I like finger flippers and of course autos. But this front flipper is going to take some, some getting used to. And then it's got this channel on both sides of the blade. And apparently, I've watched a few videos, you can get your fingernail in there and flip it up. But yeah, my old fingers are not what they used to be. So there you go. The petrified fish. Beluga. Very cool knife. At least I think so. Just wanted to share it with you. Very cool. All right, y'all. Hey, hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, like it, share it, all that good stuff. And we'll see you on the next one. Hey, hope you have a wonderful Tuesday evening. And as always, an even better tomorrow. Squatch out.